Welcome to the Sage Pastel Accounting How To video. In this video, we'll be demonstrating how to create a 13th period. A financial year typically consists of 12 periods. Sage 50C Pastel Accounting allows you to create 13 periods in a financial year. The 13th period is used to extend your financial year with one period, allowing you an extra period to finalize your year end. Please note that this step is not mandatory as setting up the 13th period is optional and normally only done if you wish to extend your financial year to allow you to continue processing while finalizing your year end. Normally a financial year consists of 12 period. The system offers a 13th period for the two exclusive reasons. The first is some organizations process 13 four week periods in one year. And the second is to extend your financial year. The latter option allows you to work in the next year while you finalize your year end. To access your 13th period, please select Setup, go to Periods, change the number of periods to 13, and then select the option Use Last Period as the first period for next year. Please note that any processing that takes place in the 13th period, when the year end process is complete, all the processing in the 13th period will now be moved to the first period of the new financial year. Another thing you also need to caution is if you're running 12 periods, you should not select the option use last period as first period of the next year. This option moves all the transactions for the last period to the first period of the new financial year. For example, in a 12 period scenario, whereby your March period starts in March 2020 to February 2021, if you have the option make last period as first period of next year tick, February 2021 will be the first period of financial. On the contrary, if you do have the 13th period, where your March period starts in March 2020 to March 2021, Having not ticked make last period as first period of next year, your April 2021 period will be the first period of the new financial year. Based on the above, if you only want to run 12 periods, do not select the option make last period as the first period of next year. If you do wish to run the 13th period, do select the option make last period as the first period of the next year. If this option is not set up correctly, you may find that your periods are incorrect after running the year end. And please note, if you are unable to change your periods, you may need to send your company data set in for a data fix. Please email supportsa at sage.com. Ensure you include your customer number, base serial number and a screenshot of the above problem.